What's up guys, it's Sean with Stump Moving and today we have a pretty cool video for you. We're heading out to Youngstown, Ohio so we can purchase a new moving body for one of our trucks. This is a, an interesting move for us because we had to we're partner with a friend of mine and then we had to rent a crane for the day. So you're not going to want to miss out. If you guys like this video, please hit that thumbs up for us. Give this video a like and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more videos just like this. Right behind me here is our new moving van body. We're gonna put this on our Freightliner M2106 that we have at the shop. Right now it has a Morgan dry freight body and it's just not doing the trick for us. So I went on the Facebook Marketplace and I located this one. Obviously there's a big hole in the front. There was an expediter who used this in the past, but we're gonna go ahead and patch that once we get it over to Lanner Enterprises. But to do that, we've hired our buddies over at RAR Transport and they're gonna take a 48 foot gooseneck hotshot out here well, these guys, Goebel's towing is gonna lift it up in the air for us. And then we're gonna bring it back to Pittsburgh so that Lander can fix it up and mount it onto the chassis. It's pretty cool, I'm very excited. This is a pretty new truck body. It's a US truck body, it's a 2017, and it's in really good shape, aside from the hole in the front. But that's gonna be really easy for our guys to patch. They're starting to lift it up off the ground. It looks like everything's going really well here. Only a couple more minutes, and my buddy Steve should be here with the flatbed any second now. So far so good. We're finishing up over here in Youngstown. We're heading back to Pittsburgh. Right now the guys are finishing up tying the body of the truck to the flatbed with chains and binders. This is going to be a lot easier than using traditional straps for flatbed loads. The chains and binders are just going to go underneath the frame rail of the body and then they're going to connect to the flatbed of the truck. Once they're done then we're going to pull out from here and head back to Pittsburgh.
Looks like they're doing a great job. So we'll get back to it. All right guys, we just finished up here at Lander Enterprises. We got the truck body offloaded. Now what they're gonna do is they're gonna patch this hole that you see right here in the front of the truck, and then there's a window on the other side. At some point in time, somebody used this as an expediting truck and they turned the attic into a sleeper. And there's actually a shower in there too, that's a little weird, but we're gonna go ahead and rip that out. In about a couple weeks, we'll have it all ready to go. And we'll show you that transformation here in the next video. You're not going to want to miss that, so subscribe to the channel. And if you enjoyed this video, hit that like button for me.